Okay, so in this third video in this sequence, I'm going to show you what happens when we try to put things into the main model, but we're in a, um, a design option instead. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK to this. Um, and I'm going to edit my um, width vestibule. Uh, I need to turn on visibility graphics, make sure that I've got uh, width vestibule those have to match up, click apply, click OK. So now I can see my vestibule. So let's say that I wanted another door over here in this south wall. So I click on architecture, I click on door, and I go in and I add my door. It gives me an error message. It says an insert in a design option cannot be hosted by an element in the main model. So how would I, what would my philosophy be for approaching that? Well, in a nutshell, what you have to do is to create a hole in the wall and then put in another chunk of wall that hosts um, either one of the design options. So I'm going to run through that real quick with you. So let me go back to manage, design options, finish editing, uh, close that. And so what I'm going to do is on the architecture tab go ahead and put a wall opening in. So I click on that wall and I create a hole in the wall and now what I have to do is put a wall in there um, as part of my design options right so right now if I switch that back to the 3d view that's what I've got is a hole in the wall so I go back to my floor plan view and I want to um, go to my manage tab and design options um, with vestibule uh, edit get that out of the way and then I'm gonna put in a chunk of wall oh, probably not that wall so um, I'm gonna select that wall and change that to the same one that I have for the rest of my exterior walls so life is good there and so now I'm still in my design option I can go back to architecture pick door put another door in there and life is good so let's pretend that we've done everything that we should do we haven't quite yet uh, so back to design options and finish editing and then close that so now my design option there is um, is to have the the two doors in the vestibule so let's go back to visibility graphics and toggle this thing back and forth a little bit and see what happen, happens. So there again in design options, vestibule options, with vestibule, and then without vestibule, click apply. And notice what happens, I've still got the hole in the wall. right? So now what I need to do is, as long as I'm here, click OK, go in and edit the without vestibule um, model, and go back to architecture, wall, chink chink uh, again it didn't keep my wall type so I need to change that to uh, brick on metal stud and there you go go back to manage um, design options finish editing close and um, I can probably clean that up a little bit but anyway so uh, visibility graphics and so now when I look at my design options without vestibule, with vestibule, click apply, there you go. Um, I need to neaten up in my without vestibule. My wall walls didn't quite connect there I guess and so they're not cleaning up the way they are in the other design options so I would have to go back and fix that. But that's the philosophy. The other thing to keep track of is when you're building this wall notice that um, you know, I didn't precisely build it as tall as the opening was, so I've got uh, some overlapping geometry there. Uh, I'd probably want to go back and edit that and clean that up as well.